So I was gonna go and leave the um today, but when I saw this headline, I had to talk about it because I know for a certain someone that loves eating hot stuff, and I couldn't pass this hot this headline up at all. And the headline says the world hottest chili pepper left a man in the hospital. And the story says, the man ended up needing hospital treatment after taking part in a chili pepper eating contest. Me Doctors eat report. A scotch bonnet me eat. Yeah, man. I didn't think I said. You know what I say? I see him how he go in and I said, when he come out. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> the 34-year-old man who has not been identified is a Carolina Reaper. The world's most fiery chili pepper. What? You ever hear about that there? Yeah, that pepper is horrible. He later experienced headaches so severe that he sought emergency treatment from doctors. According to the journal BMJ Case Reports, the man's symptoms began as soon after he ate the chili pepper with dry heaves. Mm. Mm. The only time I ever have dry heaves with me, over drink. He, yeah, for your birthday, when I did mash up. Mm -hmm, mash up and pop down. <laughs> he then developed severe neck pain and agonizing headaches, each lasting just a few seconds over the next several days. After a raft of tests, a scan showed that several arteries in his brain had constricted. Wow. The doctors diagnosed him with thunderclap. Headache secondary to reversible cere cerebral vasoconstriction syndrome. So that's RCVS. RCVS, a temporary narrowing of the arteries in the brain, can occur as a reaction to prescription or illegal drugs. Bombard. The journal said, but this is the first known case involving chili peppers. The report's authors added, however, the eating of cayenne pepper has been linked to sudden constriction of the coronary arteries and heart attacks. The man's, syndrome, sy the man's symptoms cleared up by themselves and a scan five weeks later showed his arteries had returned to normal, it said. The Guinness World Record certified the Carolina Reaper as the world hottest pepper in August of 2013. Aside from being hot, the Carolina Reaper is described as having a fruity, sweet taste with a hint of cinnamon and chocolate undertones. So, if you like a bit of fruity... Okay, with a hint of, hint of cinnamon and chocolate, the Caroline Reaper is for you. Okay, so what drew me to this article is when they said that the same symptoms that this man is going through is the same symptoms that can occur when you use prescription or illegal drugs that right there was the nail biter was the clincher was the you know when i throw one dot in the center that's what hit me i could not believe that a pepper can give you the same symptoms that prescription drugs and illegal drugs can give to you so and it also has been linked to cayenne pepper to doing the same thing. So if you eat a lot of cayenne pepper, know that you can have RCVS. And it has been linked to heart attacks. So me know my Jamaican people, them love them pepper and love them spicy food. Okay, so be careful when you're eating a lot of spicy food because it can cause constriction of your arteries. And constriction of your arteries in your brain okay your brain is a very fragile part of your body contrary to popular belief because everybody thinks that your head tough and all these things but it's a very sensitive part of your body anytime anything goes wrong there 
everything else shuts down. So comment in the comment section and tell me what you guys think about the Carolina Reaper. Would you try it? Okay. Would you try a Carolina Reaper? And did you guys know that a pepper can do the same thing or give you the same symptoms that a prescription or illegal drugs can give to you? That's how strong nature is. Comment in the comment section and tell me guys what you think about this story. And don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to your girl here on YouTube. And be careful with the pepper because they say just like how we go in and see him so we go out. So all of who want to go through them, they probably problem they good for them. Me don't want it. <laughs>